All right, man, so it's about time for me to talk about this copyright shit because one, first and foremost, it's annoying as hell. Second of all, my first YouTube video of the year from my hobby channel, can't even upload that due to copyrights, you know? And I even uploaded the video on purpose to where I don't make money. I didn't monetize it at all, uploaded it regular. Still got a message. Oh, this content, the music inside your video is owned by such and such. And, and due to that, your video is blocked inside every every country and every region. I'm like, dude, even inside the US is blocked, completely blocked, can't nobody watch it, you know? At this point, Instagram is the only social site in the whole entire history of this world right now currently it's the only site where you can upload whatever type of music you want and they don't be making a big deal out of big deal out of it as long as it's not full length songs and it's not back to back whole songs and stuff like that you know but other than that and another thing they try and stop too is from people here's this is what it is to be techni technical about it they're trying to stop people from just simply listening to music for free so in their minds i have music inside my video and people are people get to look at my video and listen to that music for free that's what they look at that's that's pretty much just all it is you know what i'm saying like that shit is sad that's but that's exactly what it is they don't want nobody to listen to the music that that they own for free unless they're streaming it unless those particular people are are paying them some type of money to watch it and that's why youtube started integrating where even though you do have copyright content inside your video they gonna still like let you know that hey this video has copyright content but the proceeds will be going directly whatever money you do pull in if you if we do decide to put ads can they tell you we're gonna put ads on your video because the copyright owners want ads and they want to make money off this content that you're using that's that's theirs i don't mind that you know what i'm saying that's the same thing they could have did with this video my new year's celebration and stuff like that letting people know how i turned up this year or last year and this year <clears throat> to begin this year off. I hardly ever go out on New Year's. So, you know, it was a nice little moment, a nice little uh, video and everything. T took a few days to even work on it and, every and everything like that, just to make sure, just to make sure it's edited pretty decent. And I just didn't want to upload it directly from my phone and just have everything together. I wanted to add titles and everything, make it, you know, make it like a, you're actually watching something, you know, not just some thrown together video. So, I put in all that work transferring the files from my phone to the laptop just to edit it and then i transferred the whole the, i rendered the video and then transferred the video from the, from my laptop back to my phone just so i can be able to upload to different social sites from my phone which i was successful at doing it on instagram but when it comes to uploading the video to youtube from my laptop and stuff like that after i was done working on it like i said you know they hit me with the copyright shit, which i don't understand especially if i'm not using it to make no money and here's the thing about it us folks that use you guys like all you different companies and music artists music we're the ones that's helping keeping y'all asses hot because every time someone watches our video they get reminded of oh you know what i'm saying they just hear the song so it, it, it keeps y'all song refreshed it's gonna get to a point where we, gonna, we ain't gonna give a fuck about using nobody else's content no more because we, we're gonna get we're gonna get tired of all this copyright shit and then y'all gonna try to reverse it like y'all did with the video games how y'all reversed it first you could not even upload no type of video games gameplay at all on youtube at all unless you're a youtube partner or own those games literally you know what i'm saying part of that company or something like that and then they kind of reversed it to where you can't upload those videos but you can't make no money off of it unless you're a youtube partner or own those videos game video games then they reversed it even further to where now you can make money off of it without being a youtube partner and without owning those games as long as you're making enough views and got the ads rolling in and stuff like that you can potentially make money over time and stuff it's the same thing that's going to happen with this music and stuff like that like y'all got to understand all you damn dumbass companies out there and your music artists don't nobody want y'all music ain't nobody trying to sell y'all music we're just trying to freaking entertain people it's like y'all trying to entertain you know what i'm saying we're trying to you know get some music that goes with our video and just boom you know what i'm saying like and my and in, in, in my case this particular video i wasn't using no background music intentionally to use as background music it's the fact that i was inside the club a couple of clubs and they playing music in the background obviously like how the hell am i supposed to upload club videos that's i'm starting to, i'm about to start doing like uh i'm gonna start filming for clubs again and stuff like that and doing vlogs while i'm filming and stuff and things of that nature how the hell am i supposed to do that you know what i'm saying like that means i'm gonna have to play like Mute the, mute the video and then play other music in the background and do voiceover like do voice commentary after the fact like don't nobody feel like doing all that don't nobody got time to do all that and stuff like that like that's just that shit is just annoying 